Alright, devil's tail. Go. Go it. Oh, keep her. I need anything? Four pill. I need bullets for anything? Hey, man, wasn't they supposed to give us some type of mission briefing or something like that? Be all right with this being the way it is. This wouldn't be a bad idea to have, right? Oh, let's just let's not overdo it. Somebody coming with us. Oh, Lindo. The director said that if I saw you, I should tell you he wishes to meet with you. Awesome. Sounds like you didn't see me then. Oh, ho. Hey there, Rook. The name's Lindo Amamia. According to various documents, I am your superior officer. But I never paid much attention to that crap, and neither should you. In game, I want you to be someone who I know has my back, and I'll have yours. Oh. Oh, who's this? A new recruit? Yup, and you're totally ruining my big scary speech about our brutal coda, so shoot! Of course, sir. You're the boss, sir. Now I lost my place, so we're cool, yeah? I'm sending you out into battle, and I know that's scary, but look, I'm gonna be right here with you. Got it? Oh, and look at the time. It's half past mission. Let's go! <laughs> half past mission, right? I wonder if there's a way I can take this stupid hat off. Man, this place has seen better days for sure. All right, Rook, we're gonna get some hands-on experience today. You got three big rules. Don't die. If you're in danger, frickin' run. And last, hide. Well, not hide, use cover. Stealth wins fights. Wait, is that four big rules then? I'm gonna bottom line it for you. Survive. Actually, yeah, let's say one big rule. Survive. All right, kid. Let's get this show on the road. Right. This is the horse field out together. I'm excited to work with you. Let's get out there. Be a pretty basic hunt. Nothing crazy or unexpected. Molly. Really? Got a substance in a game called Molly? Pure and jewel steel. I wonder if I can destroy some of this stuff. Nope.
There we go. I know it's your first time in the field. Just remember to stay calm. Watch their movements and strike when you see an opening. Yeah, so you shouldn't stand right in front of the Circle around and counter it. Oh, yeah. Oh, we failed in the field. Yep. Those are pretty basic. I don't just hand out compliments. So when I say you moved well out there for a recruit, I mean it. I wonder if it's a way you can lock on and the camera can lock on to what you're looking at. Because this is kind of iffy. number to the right of each character's name is their endurance, which will decrease if their HP is, reaches zero. If another character endurance reaches zero, they cannot perform a link aid. And if your own reaches zero, you will fail the mission. Characters that participate in missions receive AP. A can be used towards personal abilities. Character skills that match your style of play, you can view the personal abilities from the terminal. of ground to cover so what do you say we just jump right in now what do you think an origami is lots of words come to mind the apex predator the devourer of mankind god's given flesh well those are all right in a way these phrases while dramatic aren't misconceptions rather you could say they simply evolve from wonderment the speaker clearly has their eyes fixed on the phenomena before them today we are striving for a deeper answer Tell me, have you ever wondered from whence the origami come? History books tell us that they just appeared, as though from the air itself. Since then, their numbers have grown. Strange, no? As though they are ripping through the very core of evolutionary process. <sighs> hey, hey, does this lecture have an intermission? Or a point? Our job's to kill them. What does it matter where they come from? Oh, it matters! <laughs> <laughs> have no heart. Neither do they have a brain or a digestive system or spinal fluids. Frail humans that we are, a powerful strike to the chest would cripple or kill. Us. But no, that won't bring down an origami. You see, these beasts are clusters of oracle cells. Each individual my shit just spiked. organism of its own, ever devouring the others. I turn my volume down and it just Perhaps, spikes up. But each origami is a colony of hundreds, nay thousands of individual life forms, each striving to survive. And this dangerous, deadly, elegant fusion of cells cannot be destroyed by conventional weapons. They are impervious to all assault. So, how then are we meant to survive? How can we defeat such a powerful predator? Um, well, they die when we hit them a lot with the God Ark, or shoot them a lot with the God Ark, so... Precisely! A God Ark! A biological weapon infused with the same oracle cells that inhabit an origami's body. That's the key. They are the only weapons capable of cutting through their ever-fusing oracle cells. But just cutting them down will do no good. The rogue cell colonies will grow and heal, or worse, form new monsters to be defeated. No, there is only one way to ensure victory. Tearing out the core. The cells that serve as a control center. But of course, such a task is challenging to say the least. Even with our god arcs, we have no way to deliver such a devastating blow. At some point, people recognized in these monsters, in their immortality, the spirits of the many gods once worshipped here. They deem these creatures aragami, and we fight them still. I think that's as good a place as any to hold for today. As homework, please refer to the Norn database for more on the history of aragami. Dismiss! Uh -huh. You can change and upgrade equipment, craft items, manage your inventory, and save your progress at terminals. 
the check. Oh, well, you just told us that. Oh, oh man, oh, here we go. So this is how you check it. You check mail and use your okay. information on the bullet editor, like only strengths and weaknesses. Other information will help you start the game. Hey, so you're a new type of person, huh? You best remember who here. It's to me, it's Kane. We met in the corridor.